Boyd and Presley found a secret out this year that he was once a pharaoh when Egyptians ruled the world and now the sorcerer named Scarab tries to get up day and night. But Presley has more guardians to protect his very life. He has a mummy. From 
It could pull in signals from Mars and Mr. Huxley'd probably still give me a C. This doesn't look like a shortwave radio to me. Does it work? Of course it works. You were supposed to make it yourself. Uh, I'd better check my notes. They're in my locker. There's something strange about that boy. Oh, I see the problem. He uh, forgot to plug it in. I should have looked at Raph's notes before I set it up. Huxley? Where's Mr. Huxley? He was here just a minute ago. He's gone. I've taken his place. You mean like a substitute teacher? Substitute teacher? Sure. I am Chantra. Uh, nice to meet you, Miss Chantra. What is this? That's my science project. Hmm. I recognize this handiwork. Only Wrath could have made this obelisk. He must still be alive. I wouldn't exactly say alive. Oops, uh, I mean, uh, actually, no, uh, I don't know anybody named Rath. Why would I? Look into my <gasps> eyes and speak the truth. Rath is my tutor and my guardian because the spirit of Rapses was reborn in me. Rath is no longer your tutor, Rapses. From now on, you belong to me. to be an explanation for what's happened to me. After all, there's an explanation for everything. You're new here, aren't you? I must be dreaming. Yeah, that makes sense. I'm dreaming. I'll just wake myself up. Wake up! be coming here for my lessons anymore. I'm going, I'm going to be studying, studying under a new teacher at my school. Who is going to teach you a jitsu? You have to learn from an expert. Are you angry, Prince? Because your science project didn't work? It isn't that I'm turning against you. It's just that I have to move on. There's no more that you can teach me. I have to go home now. My new teacher's coming over. We cannot let him just leave like that. He needs us. We are his guardians. And he is the Pharaoh now. We can't defy his commands. Perhaps Prince Rapses is right. Perhaps he needs a teacher from his own world. What do you think, Raph? Hmm. What he said... It... It reminds me of something from long ago. It was when the Pharaoh called me to the palace to become Rapsi's tutor. It isn't that I'm turning against you, it's, it's just that it's time for you to move on. There's no more I can teach you. You told me I'm the best student you ever had. Maybe even more than that. Prince Rapsi's is my student now. Will Pharaoh's son ever learn to do this? Hear me, O oh serpents of the underworld. Stop showing off, Chantra. 
I must obey Pharaoh's command, even if my heart commands me to stay. You'll pay for this, Wrath. Someday you'll pay. No, it couldn't be. It couldn't be her. You're the best teacher I ever had, Miss Chantra. Mr. Huxley never used to come over and help me with my homework. Hmm. Where is Mr. Huxley, anyway? <laughs> it's almost like you're learning science along with him. Where can I learn more? I must know more. Didn't you study science in college? Can I talk to you for a minute, Ms. Chantra? Alone? Presley's never been so interested in science before. I think he has a crush on you. I don't understand crush. I think I will take Presley with me to this place you mentioned, this college. I don't think so. Not until he stops acting like a lovesick puppy. Yeah, I can't help it. I have that effect on people. Look into my eyes. You really shouldn't wear so much mascara. I don't need your beauty secrets. I don't know about you, but I'm bored. This place is really dead without Rapsies. <sighs> Truly, a teacher is lost without a student. I think I'll go see what he's up to. Wait, Nefertina. We must only go to the house of Rapsies when he needs us. If a bird flies too often to the nest, the hungry cat may follow. Maybe we could call him and ask him to come over. Hey, it works with pizza. I need the round piece of metal with the face of the great pharaoh, George Washington. I have one. Great is the power of George Washington! Uh, pizza by the pound. Is this pickup or delivery? There's nobody named Presley here. You have to dial Rapsy's number. There is more than one number? Oh, here, let me do it. How are we gonna get to Berkeley? Take my hand, Rapsies. I'll show you something Wrath never taught you. Whoa! Hello? Presley isn't here. He went to the Berkeley Library with his new teacher, Ms. Chantra. Chantra? <laughs> Presley's in grave danger! pieces of metal. <laughs> Great is the power of George Washington! What does Chantra want, Rath? Revenge against me, and she'll destroy Rapsies to get it. Knowledge is power, Rapsies. That is why Rath was afraid to teach me. But now, I'll have my revenge. Not yet, Chantra. Ra! Hmm? I've come to take you home, Rapsies. Tell him, Rapsies. Chantra is my teacher now, but Rath... Rath is my friend. He's breaking free from your spell, Chantra. Then I'll cast another. Look into my eyes. Look into your own eyes! Ah! I know your tricks, Chantra. I was going to destroy you eventually. I might as well do it now. Why did Wrath want to face this Chantra alone? They have a personal score to settle. <laughs> Looks like she scored first. What happened, Raph? Just doing some light reading. Oh, 
Get away from him, or I'll destroy you too. With the strength of Rock! A sword can strike both ways. My magic is stronger than your weapons. You can't hurt me. You were afraid to teach me. She's too strong for you, Rath. Sorry. Stay away from him, Rapsies. I'll be your student, Chantra, but only if you let Wrath go. This was never about you. Wrath used you once to get rid of me. Now I'm using you to get rid of him. Wrath was afraid to teach me because he knew my power would become greater than his. You're right, Chantra. I was afraid. I was afraid that I was falling in love with you. Of course. I wanted you to. While you taught me magic, I cast a spell over you. You had the strength to break free then, but my magic is stronger now. Oh, hear me, those serpents that guard the underworld. <laughs> You're pathetic, Raph. There are no mystic serpents anymore. That was 3,000 years ago. A different world. Not serpents, Chandra, but underground power cables. You haven't learned everything about this modern world. Wake up, Huxley. Wake up, Huxley. Oh, knock it off. Ah! 
Where, where am I? Hey, there's my old college dorm. How did I get here? Presley's science project must have given me quite a shock. Uh, that's it. The shock gave me amnesia. Yes, amnesia. You know, it's funny. Even though I know Chantra was evil, I keep thinking about how beautiful she was. <sighs> so do I, my prince. So do I.